Hey everybody, Paul Angelo here. Welcome to another video. Thank you for being here with me on this journey of learning. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe so that we learn together. Also, if you're not part of the Big Gay Family social program, please join us. Visit the website biggayfamily.com and meet men differently. And now let's continue with the rest of the video. Hey everybody, Paul Angelo here. Welcome to another deeper dive into dating strategy, into a new philosophy for dating so that this time around, you are absolutely guaranteed an amazing social empire. Not just a friend, not just a lover, but the entire enchilada, the entire social empire. Six to seven friends, celebrations of events, birthdays, trips, a lover at home, getting married. That's what this dating strategy, this dating philosophy is going to show you how to do. So here is how we all date each other right now out there in the public world with online dating websites, hookup apps, grinders, scruffs, and the rest of it. In most situations, it's basically hit and run. You meet a lot of people, but you don't connect with them. You meet a lot of people, but you basically just bump against each other and then walk away. Happens, rejection, abandonment, trauma. That's what most people experience today. No wonder we are frustrated. No wonder we are anxious. No wonder our mental health is deteriorating. No wonder we are all lonely at home, sitting and watching Netflix shows and YouTube videos. So how do we change this? Well, there is one common ingredient in a lot of the dysfunctional dating strategies today. The one common ingredient is short duration or hit and run, basically one time dating commitment style. So in most situations where people say, I want to go out on a date with you, they just committing to one date and then see what happens. Now in this long duration dating, which is the new philosophy for dating that we're going to talk about here, we commit to 90 days of interactions. Obviously not every day, but three interactions each month. So three months of interactions, and three times three, so a total of nine interactions across the span of 90 days. This, my friends, changes everything. Let's come back to mental health. I hope that you know that all around us are narcissistic men and narcissistic people cannot produce a loving connection. If you've never studied narcissism, Narcissism is a situation where a person has had severe trauma in his youth and he now has a very defensive disposition to the world. Whenever you have a conflict or whenever you want to ask that person to change something, change their communication or go out on a date with you in a way that's comfortable for you, they're going to be defensive. They're not going to want to cooperate. So men who are narcissistic, are men who have had a trauma in their youth and now are acting it out, it's very difficult to create a connection with them. They're very defensive. And that is just a summary of narcissism. Studying narcissism is very important. But in this video, we're talking about dating. So I just want to share with you a brief synopsis of how narcissistic people are not healthy for dating. So we have narcissism out there, we have psychopathy, we have sociopathy, we have people with borderline personality disorders, with bipolar disorders, we have men out there who are sex addicts, we have men out there who have been traumatized to such a level where they treat everybody like an object. So it's helpful as we talk about this new dating philosophy that you become familiar with the reality of this social experience in this world. It's not a healthy world to begin with. And recognizing this is very important because that's how you choose which dating strategy you're going to use. Are you going to go with the one commitment, one date dating strategy? Or are you going to go with the other one, which is 90 days of commitment, where you actually get to know each other? I personally would choose the 90-day commitment time because that's how I get to know the person across the span of enough time that I get to know them. I get to know their strengths. I get to know their weaknesses. I get to know their story. I get to know their suffering. 
Sometimes people share secrets when they get to know each other better. Sometimes you get to know things about a person you would have never gotten to know because you only give them a, such a limited amount of time, like one date or two dates. Once we have the long duration dating strategy, everything becomes healthier. All the men that are toxic, they're not going to want to participate here. Because remember, all the toxic men out there, they're not interested in connecting. And even if they say to themselves that they are interested in connecting and dating, they're doing it in such a wrong way, you don't want to be in their pathway because they're going to traumatize you. A lot of the men out there who are so hardcore about sex, they're so hardcore about their attraction, they are looking to just meet with you. And if you don't fit in with their attraction fantasy, they just want to reject you right there on the spot. And that is trauma. We have what's called an attachment style. This is a very well-known concept in psychology. There is the insecure attachment style. There is the ambivalent attachment style. And there's the secure attachment style. So the secure person recognizes that when we go out there and meet people, that we want to get to know them, spend time with them. An insecure person will look for situations to protect themselves. And they're going to often reject the other person because they're going to be afraid that they will reject them. And then a person that's ambivalent, they're just not going to care at all. Maybe they'll show up. Maybe they won't show up. They're just ambivalent. So there are a lot of people out there. In fact, most gay men today are either ambivalent or insecure. And in those attachment styles, in those dating strategies that they produce, it's very bumpy. It's very traumatic. It's very unhealthy. And so inviting everybody to this commitment to 90 days not only removes all the toxic people out there, the narcissists, psychopaths, sociopaths, sex addicts, all the people who, whose humanity has been washed away by years of trauma, and then they treat everybody else like a sex object. So this dating strategy removes all of them, and also this dating strategy removes all of the improper dating situations that happen with healthy men who just don't know any better. This dating strategy that we are talking about right now is part of the Biggie Family Social Program. So when you receive introductions, everyone that you meet, you're going to commit to 90 days of interactions. And in the span of those 90 days, there will be all kinds of things happening that otherwise would never happen. So typically when you have a hit and run, with someone or when you have only one date or two dates, you don't have a chance to really practice communication skills. You don't have a chance to taste the experience of another person. Who are they? How do they talk? How do they react when things get a little bit heated up, when there are conflicts, when there are controversial topics that you talk to them about? You see, in most situations, we don't have access to the depth of human interaction. And so we get out of practice, we make a lot of mistakes, and we don't really experience intimacy anymore. Most people think that intimacy can only be experienced with sex, but intimacy can also be experienced with conversation. You can have a shared intimacy that comes out of a shared experience of getting to know each other. And that requires longer than three dates. That often requires enough time so that people can witness each other throughout a few cycles of feeling connected, then feeling disconnected, then feeling connected again, and recognizing that the connection and disconnection just comes and goes, and the intensity of how you feel pleasure about this person also comes and goes. And we need to have this moment of stabilizing that way of equilibrium, that way of feeling comfortable in each other's presence. And often that comes as a result of conflict. That comes as a result of fixing disagreements. That requires some volatility in the way how you interact with each other. And this volatility, I call this the heartbeat. Often when people come into each other's lives, we would imagine that it would be an easy kind of simple thing, but it's not. It, it often is a volatile process depending on how strong people are. Personalities come in different 
different levels and different flavors. I have a very strong personality. I am very direct. And if someone enters my life, that directness usually produces a clash, a conflict. And as long as that person sustains through that, as long as I sustain through it and don't walk away, eventually we become best friends or we become good friends. We have this trust that can develop. And so with you and long duration dating, you're going to have a lot more going on when you commit to get to know someone for an extended amount of time. All the situations that create a human connection, now these situations will be happening versus before you don't even get to second date. You don't even get to third date. You don't even get to the sixth date, which is a validation that you are really trying to make something happen, that something real is possible. So imagine with every person that you meet inside the Big A Family Social Program, with every one of them, you spend 90 days together. Just imagine how relaxed you're going to be, how free of ghosting, rejections, judgments, and criticism you're going to be. Just imagine how much more relaxed the entire experience is going to be so that you can feel comfortable being yourself again. You don't have to be afraid that he's going to disappear, that he's going to walk away because you're going to say the wrong thing. Say the wrong thing. Do whatever feels natural for you. Be yourself and don't be afraid of speaking your truth. Don't be afraid of speaking your opinions because you are protected by this 90-day protection zone where no matter what happens, you both are committed to 90 days of interactions. Imagine how much fun this is going to be. Previously, you had to tiptoe around everybody. You had to filter yourself. You had to pretend that you are excited and charismatic to impress somebody. Here, you don't have to do that anymore because you have 90 days and a lot of interactions where you can demonstrate who you are. You can demonstrate your personality, your quirky side, the flavor of your personality, which a lot of times is not visible when you only meet someone one time. So we never really get to know anybody when we spend only one date with another person. So this is, my friends, a dating philosophy that's going to help you understand that there is a way to meet wonderful men. There is a way to connect with them. But this is the proper way, not the hit and run dating, which in reality, we can't even call it dating. For dating to be called dating, we have to have the presence of the intention. We have to have the readiness to communicate, the readiness to open up ourselves to another person. And then with that intention to connect and the openness, we enter into the dating situations expecting to open up even more and get to know other people. So this 90-day commitment to getting to know another person is something self-evident. But for some reason, this has been completely erased from all dating platforms, all dating apps. And it's all about speed dating. It's all about hit and run. It's all about sexual compatibility. It's all about attraction. And if you don't fit in any of those modes, just get out. And you are ghosted. And you are hurt. And you are rejected. And so that's, my friends, what we are up against. And to filter out all these people and all these toxic situations, we present to you, I present to you, and I'm gently asking you to join us here at the Biggie Family Social Program so that you can taste this, I present to you the long duration dating, 90-day commitment, and all kinds of exercises, all kinds of communication, homeworks that you're going to be doing from day one until the third month. And in that process, you're going to open up like a flower to another person. They're going to open up to you. And as a result of that, you're going to have a chance for real and beautiful friendships, real and beautiful relationships, opportunities for love, because this time 
you shine with your personality, you shine with depth, with your ideas, with your quirkiness, with all the things that are simply invisible when you only date for one date or a second date. When you apply this dating strategy to your life, everything will change. You will no longer carry all the stress, all the anxieties, all the depression, all the loneliness, that will change in the first 30 days. Also, something very special is going to happen. You're going to believe in love again. You're going to realize that for love and relationships to happen, we needed a different setup, a different ways of coming together. That as long as we do that, love and relationships can thrive. But because of the lack of innovation on all the dating platforms. That's why this kind of innovation has never reached your home and your personal life. Nobody out there is innovating with dating. It's all the same. The only innovation is about sex. The only innovation is about adding these weird things to these websites and dating apps like how to ban or block somebody Yes, they add all kinds of features like that, but they don't think about how to add those kind of features that help you succeed. And that's the difference between all the other dating platforms and hookup apps and dating apps out there. They will innovate technologically. Here we are innovating psychologically and sociologically. We are giving you the perfect environment for meeting gay men. A perfect environment, kind of like a pond. Like if you were a frog and you want to meet other frogs, you jump into the frog pond and you start jumping around with every frog out there. And as a result, you connect to a lot of frogs and you have amazing relationships. So that's what this long duration dating is about. You have a lot of time and inside Big Gay Family, you have a lot of people. So now you have the best world for creating the best relationships of your life. There are very few places now where you're going to make mistakes because all the toxic people are removed. All the toxic situations are removed. So now it's just you with your heart, with your spirit, and now a whole bunch of people in front of you waiting to get to know you and every one of them for 90 days. It will be impossible for you to fail. And this, my friend, is the new dating philosophy that will change your life. I have chills right now talking about this because as I speak this, I'm realizing this is magic. This is what we've been waiting for our lives, for a dating platform to commit to integrity, to commit to virtue, to commit to creating the kind of environment where everybody who's there is healthy, comes together in a healthy way, and relationships happen to every single person without exception. And that's what my friends, the Big Gay Family Social Program is all about. That's why I spent a lot of time reading about psychology and sociology and technology. That's why innovation is what's missing, what has been missing in the gay world all these decades. And now it's back. My friends, this is good news. We are going to innovate our way out of loneliness. We're going to innovate our way out of anxieties and depression with dating and relationships. Everything's going to change for the better when we are committed to innovating, when we are committed to healthy principles for dating and relationships. And when you join the Big Gay Family Social Program, you are in a good place where this innovation is tested, this innovation is practiced and perfected. And that's how we stand out as the most innovative social program in the world where many of you are going to find your new friends and lovers when you join us. And if you want to see testimonials, if you want to see the proof of that, then come to the website at biggayfamily.com and see for yourself. 
Okay, my friends, I'm super excited to see you in the program. So to join us, visit the website biggayfamily.com and begin enrollment. Also, if you are new to my channel, I kindly ask you to subscribe so that we learn and grow together. And as always, I'm very excited to talk to you again in the future video and podcast. And I'm looking forward to sharing with you more and more and more in the year 2023. So thanks for watching and I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care.